I have a confession to make. I really like the show Arcane. Like, I really, really like it. I wouldn't go as far as to say I'm obsessed with Arcane. That, I feel like that'd be a little weird. A couple months ago, I was looking through the r slash mechanical keyboard subreddit as you do, when I came across this post from Antidote Studios, showcasing their Jinx inspired keycap set. And you know, I wasn't sure if I wanted it, the legending wasn't my favorite, I didn't know how high quality it was, the shipping costs were a little high, it took 5 months to arrive. But before I open it up, I'll walk you through the arcane inspired build I had in mind. For the case, I'll be using the GK61XS Barebones Kit which Banggood was nice enough to send to me about 7 months ago, which makes this video 7 months late. It's a 60% hot swap barebones kit with 5 pin support, all in a plastic case. I did mod this case off camera by adding switch pads to the PCB and o-ring mounting it to try and make it sound and feel a little better. The stabs on the GK61 kinda suck, till I got some blue Everglide plate mounts to match the theme. These have been looted with Crytox 205 Grade 0 on the housings with dielectric grease on the wires. Once the stabs were done, I'll be adding Shimmer into this build, in the form of the Boba LTs. I've done a full review on these switches, but what you should know is that these are pretty scratchy but also very deep sounding, and the purple colorway matches Shimmer quite nicely. And with all that out of the way, it's finally time to show off the keycaps. But I think we need a better matching desk mat. I think this one should do. Antidote designed it in-house and it costs around $35. Finally, these are the Jinx keycaps from Antidote Studios. They cost around $60 and come in a 132 key kit. With a ton of Jinx related novelties such as the Fishbones Backspace, Monkey Bomb Escape Key, Cloud Tattoo Tab, and many, many more. They're XDA Dye Sub PBT keycaps with a listed 1.5mm thickness. Also included is a unique ID card for each order. I got the 20th set as well as a keycap puller and a special novelty key for pre-orders. Here's how the Arcane Jinx keyboard turned out. This build turned out really good. I love the Boba LTs here and they do so much for this keyboard in terms of acoustics. The stabs actually turned out half decent, the spacebar is a little overlooed but oh well, and the case turned out really nice after the mods, though it's still on the hollow side. The keycaps though, they're definitely the star of the show. I really like the color gradient on the legending, the font isn't my favorite but the novelties more than makes up for it. I did contact Antidote Studio and they did say they're looking into releasing sets based on other arcane characters such as Vi and Echo and I really hope that they do. These keycaps are super unique and have a lot of charm to both arcane and league fans but also as a standalone keycap set. I hope you guys did enjoy this build, this video is completely different to any other that I've done before. Let me know what you guys think of this change in style. I have links to everything I use in the description, as well as the GK61XS kit if you're interested. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And if you're looking to chat with keyboard or arcane fans, I'll leave a link to my discord server over in the description. Oh, and follow my twitter too please. I'm way more active over there than any other platform and if you need to reach me, that's where I'll be. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.